okay in sure it's it's a rod <coughs> light rod rod of length r by 2 radius of cavity smaller uh, how the how the various force of the backing so the force rather than saying tension no let me take that force this will be the mg why we have to show the force like this because it's a rod it will be pushing this particular ball and similarly this rod will be pushing this particular ball and, and that push by the rod on the ball will be in this direction okay good this impact which we are supposed to calculate no the force of let this be n2 this and is asking that n2 and n1 this is theta okay let's write all the possible i, I think what is the constraint equation how how the direction even this will have acceleration a to horizontal so what is the constraint equation a1 cos theta should be equal to a2 sin theta theta is 45 degrees so therefore a1 and therefore condition like this uh, i don't know what to do today is uh, voice problem huh? uh continue maybe i to i have two connections i am changing both uh, even problem is it problem with the zoom software or my net just wait ah huh? i'll do i'll change setting okay can you hear me yes sir Uh, there's a problem with the zoom software uh, not not with connectivity when number of users becomes more no so that that website will will have this this a thing okay no no f cos theta equal to m1 then ma2 so and we have constant equation solving that <laughs> so okay from that we'll get the value of f anybody value of f ah oh, mg by root 2 no no let's come for the interaction force so n1 n1 minus mg minus f sin theta equals 0 we know f we know mg so from that we'll get n1 n1 minus 
this will be mg by root 2 this is 1 by root 2 similarly Okay, this is what the force of interaction. Huh? Mg by two, sir. N two. N two mg by two. Huh? I see like uh, what are the things now definitely you want to ask like what is the stress in the rod i'll give angst model what is the stress of course the elongation or the deformation will be very small so if you ask stress then i think we can go for like this no f by s let s be the area of cross section assume that the deformation the rod is very small compared to dimensions of the cavity in that case what happen we can so now what is the Uh, increase will will rod will undergo compression or elongation? Anybody? Elongation. No, it's a rod. No. It tends to elongate, but it is fixed. Ah, see, no, 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 not like. It say say like a they say like a here. What is this F by the rod on the ball? No, by the ball on the rod will be like this. We have to show it similar by the ball on the rod should be like this. Huh? It will tend to undergo compression. No, not elongation. A compressive stress or or say like a elongative stress. So it will be compressive stress will be developed here. Of course, that will be very negligible. Just um, maybe is interested to more than one option. No, he may ask you that particular thing. Force of interaction between the ball and the cavity. The stress will develop in the compressive or tensile. Usually, it is tensile means elongation. Compressive means tensile stress or compressive stress. So, compressive stress it. 